Hey collective, I'm back with another energy read. It looks good, y'all. So this is definitely gonna be um a love energy that I'm picking up. I'm getting that somebody honestly sees the potential in you. They're seeing you transform and grow. Okay, I'm getting that this is somebody who watched you at a distance. Um, this is definitely a new energy, so this is not somebody that you may know this person, but you you haven't had any real relationship with them but it's like they're admired by your strength they see you at a distance and it's like yeah i, I like that i'm also getting that yeah i see i like your vibe um this is somebody who also like i said they see the potential in you this is somebody who could want to help you on your journey whether it's your spiritual journey or just whatever it is you got going on i also or like if you're looking for your purpose you're going to find it so <clears throat> this is for people who you know trying to find their like purpose what it is that they're here to do you could be in that energy right now like you know what it is i'm also getting that somebody could be very like they could like things a particular way um like they don't like like i don't know it's something about somebody wants to come to me but it's like they're being very strategic they also like i said they like something a particular way so this is somebody who's not going to just jump and do something if they're not sure of it if they don't if they not i wouldn't say like if they're not sure because people say it's good to take chances but this is somebody who's like usually when they take that chance they they know what it is that they're doing okay so, or this could be you, like, you know, maybe you made a lot of mistakes in life. So, it's like now you're not, you're cautious about the moves you make. You know what I'm saying? I feel like you're, whoever this is, like, you got a lot to lose. So, it's like you're not about to just risk it all or crash out about nothing that, you know what I'm saying, that you worked so hard to build. I feel like this could be you or this person. Yeah, okay, you got to respect each other's feelings. So, I feel like the energy, like, you know understanding one another or at least trying to understand one another if somebody say oh i don't like that you did this or i don't like it's like being respectful about it not um downplaying how somebody feel somebody is very sensitive when it comes to you too like they sensitive as fuck okay so you have watching your page like what they see like i said this is somebody who's watching you from a distance and it's like they're admired by you and they i'm hearing the word appreciate so it's like they appreciate what you stand for who you are as a person like i feel like it'd be so many females you know out here just living life in the fast lane people don't have no worries no nothing like you know they just living you know what i'm saying i feel like they see you you know trying to make a way trying to figure this shit out and it's like they they respect that you understand? You have a lot of first-time memories. Knows when to give you space. It's giving what it's supposed to give and healthy friends. So, maybe this is a friend or... Like, this This is somebody who could be a friend and, and they have feelings for you. Or, like I said, they... Um, I don't know why I'm hearing 21 Savage. Like, um... We said, I got feelings for you. Hope you ain't loving the crew. How many bodies you got? Praying ain't more than a few. So this is this person. <laughs> this is this person. Like, they they feeling you. You know what I'm saying? I feel like they're not going to judge you based on your past. But they do want to get to know you. This person wants to know everything about you. It's like, it's your energy, though. Like, it's giving what it's supposed to give. Like, it's like, would it come out under they watching your page, liking what they see? It's like I said, you could be somebody. I'm getting, like, a motivational speaker. Or, you know, if, if even if you're not, it's just, like, the things you put on social media or, you know, when you speak on certain things. It's like, that gives this person an opportunity to kind of get to know you a little bit. Like, okay, this is what this person, you know, this is how they think a little bit. Not to say you could know somebody like like that, but this person watch you enough to study you. They, they like, they see something that they like. I'm also getting that this person is not going to be the type to 
to give you um like to give problem or like this is somebody like if you say oh you know i'm i'm gonna go out and have a self-care day i'm gonna you know spend a day or even if you say a weekend like oh you know i'm gonna spend this weekend doing whatever like away from this person they're gonna understand like you know absence makes the heart grow fonder this person is realizing like maybe somebody dealt with codependency issues or like um abandonment issues but it's like this person don't feel like they need to be that way with you you know like maybe in the past um you like if somebody said your person said they was going out or doing whatever it's like you would kind of you know look at raise your eyebrow like what you going out like not, not what you going out for but like you know like maybe it was it was some sort of trust issue this person is not gonna have that they're gonna realize like they could trust you whether you're in their face or behind their back like this is somebody who knows like I, I could let my guard down like i don't gotta be so i'm also getting that because this healthy friends came card, card came out you guys are gonna build that relationship that friendship so where this person kind of knows you they know like like you know how like say you meet somebody like say you have a friendship with somebody before y'all get in the relationship so it's like you kind of see what type of person this is whether you've seen them in the other in other relationships or whether you you know see them deal with other people like this not gonna be for everybody but it's like y'all seeing what type of person they are so it's like and even if you met this person while they single and they're not in a relationship you see what type of person they are, what they do with their free time, you know, because there's some people who feel like, oh, I'm single, like, oh, I'm going on a date with this person, that person, Cause I feel like whoever you are, you and this person are getting comfortable enough to where y'all opening up about certain things you may not even realize that this person is paying attention to. I feel like this is somebody who pay attention to the small details. This is somebody who, like, things you think they're not paying attention to, they are. Okay, you got Halloween baby coming out, living y'all best life, and this new love, the new love is worth the wait. So, somebody could be having a baby on Halloween. Yeah, we know Halloween just passed, but like maybe next year or whatever the situation is, because I'm getting like, with new, this new love is worth the wait. This is somebody who, um, or well, somebody's birthday could be on Halloween. Somebody could have just celebrated their birthday. Or well, definitely Scorpio, because I picked up 21 Savage. 21 Savage is definitely a Scorpio. So this person's could, birthday could have been on a Halloween. Or you guys, you know, y'all might be having a baby next year on Halloween. Who knows? But I feel like y'all going to be living y'all best life. And Spirit is wanting you to know, like, be patient. Because what's coming in for you is well worth it. It's well deserved. This is something that you've prayed for and it's coming together i also get like this person is having look i can't make it up you ha it has having visions of y'all together b and j style so this person is definitely you know seeing y'all live this life and then you got living y'all best life together so it's like seeing y'all live live you know live a lavish life and then look like i said pays attention to every detail with you so things that you think this person is not paying attention to they are this is somebody who they they want to know what's your favorite color what's your like they want this is somebody who's going to know these things without you having to say yeah um signs and symbols and this is definitely somebody who pays attention this is somebody who's very in tune with the universe okay they know look i can't make it up you got signs and symbols meant to be in halloween something is significant about halloween something is significant about halloween like You and this person could have hung out on Halloween. But they know, like, this person could even got confirmation on who you are on Halloween. It's like this person is knowing that this is meant to be. Like, regardless of whatever's going on, whatever mishaps, because you got respectful of each other's feelings. So it's like, even when things do come up and y'all know it's miscommunication or, you know, um, you know, a little conflict, it's like y'all still know how to give each other space y'all still know how to res be respectful of one another's feelings i'm getting like it ain't gonna be too much like 
arguments and, and conflict. Like, this is not what this person is about. Stubborn. <laughs> somebody knows. Somebody knows who you are. They're, they're just being stubborn right now. This person, this person is not wanting to come towards you. You got a new job. Somebody could also want to offer you a job. It's like this person is being guided guided to do something. Like I said, this person sees the potential in you. Okay, yeah. With this leveling up and um, hidden truth, this person, this person could be somebody else that is like, this could be somebody who could put you on, put you in a position to win. They're knowing that. Like, but like I said, this person, this is somebody who's just not going to jump. And, and like, this is somebody who's going to take the time and make sure they know what it is that they're doing. Because they're not, they not feeling the, to lose everything they worked hard for. Simple. I feel like this person built a life from the ground up. And there's, and it, yeah, you got gratitude behind the scenes. I do feel like this person is very grateful for you, though. This person is very grateful for you. They're they're um happy that you are in their life. I feel like this is somebody who's learning a lot from you, whether they say it or not. And they're admired and they're like I they appreciate it. They appreciate you. This is somebody who's not showing their feelings though. They're not showing their hand. They're not showing these emotions. This is this is one like he this person is funny. Yeah, someone is not who they appear to be. This person is not like this person is hot and how they feel. This is somebody who's really this person is shielding their emotions right now like crazy. Like crazy. It could be coming off a little bit childish. You know, I'm not even going to lie, but I feel like this person is guarded. Like they want to make sure that <laughs> Like, I don't know. It's like, this is the year. At the end of the day, y'all all gonna be celebrating, though. But this is this is somebody who, yeah. Because I feel like once y'all get there, that's where it's headed. Yeah, marriage and proposal. This is, this is, this could be, a, this masculine could be like, um or whoever. Like, not um practicing celibacy right now. So, it's like, they know the next person that they invest their time, love, energy, and money into. This is somebody that they, they about to spend the rest of their life with. But it's something about your energy that do it for them. I'm telling you, this person is really watching you in the shower. But it's like they have something to give. I'm also hiding like with this. You see how he is in the shadows, but he got like a gold crown in his hands. He's holding a gold crown in his hands like this. I'm getting that this somebody who really like what they have to offer is worth it. That's why I said this new love is worth the wait. But this person is definitely in the shadows. They, they're healing, you know. Whatever they got going on. <laughs> yeah, this person is definitely healing. Because I feel like in a way, they got they kind of got childish ways. But it stemmed from being with people who were childish. You know what I'm saying? Not really being able to trust or put... Like I said, this is some. I feel like this is an energy who's very militant. Like they stand on... Like, it's like, this is a I said what I said type of person. So, it's like, the minute you you give them any sign, like, that they got to look, like, raise that eyebrow, they going back to the drawing board. You know what I'm saying? But I do feel like every time they come back to the drawing board, it always ends up back with you. Like, so it's like something that they're having to work through. You know, everybody got healing. We got all, we all got healing we need to do. But I do feel like every time this person go to that drum boy, they come back to you like, okay. And this is why it's like, okay, you got ladies, man, the player, conflict. This is somebody who could have been a ladies, man, who could have been a player. You know what I'm saying? Or they, this is somebody who like to keep it player. So this is somebody who, ain't, like I said, they ain't going to tell you how they really feeling. Or like, this is somebody who assumes you're supposed to just know how they feeling. But they realize that like they got to speak up. They can't just assume because whoever you are, you, you're aware that they want you. I feel like this is causing some sort of conflict in uh, some inner con or some conflict between the two of you. 
Like I said, this person got a little bit of childish ways. I'm going to say because it's out here. This person is stubborn. But they want you. It's like your energy. You're somebody who's whole. I feel like, yeah, this person, this person is avoiding you. And I feel like, yeah, because... It's it's a crush. I, I feel like this person is avoiding you because you know how like when you like somebody and um you start liking them a little bit. Somebody feels like they like you too much. So it's kind of like let me like somebody trying to pace themselves kind of. That's why that stopping card here. Yeah, with this um shadow work inner child, I feel like you could be um triggering them to do some sort of shadow work or you could have because you have been um practicing shadow work and this and healing. This person is like Okay, like, they, you know how, like, when you see some, like, this, I feel like this person is trying to heal as well. So, it's like, when they see that somebody is healing, it's kind of like, okay, you know, like, it's like somebody is shy, but, yeah. I'm telling you, you trigger something in this person. This person could have really dealt, yeah, higher purpose. I'm telling you. It's something about you that's like, like, it brings this person some sort of comfort, even if they don't want to admit it. This person is not wanting to admit, like just how how good you make them feel but at the same time this person does not want to continue in this player energy this person does not want to have this benef friends with benefits type of energy this is somebody who wants something solid and like i said this could be a person who is well off so they not they don't they're not looking for love you know what i'm saying like this person don't they're not looking for love but this is something that you know every everybody wants yeah, I'm telling you, this is somebody who's very militant. And they stand on business. They stand on business. I feel like they could have had they they have options. They could be going on dates. But it's like it's something about your energy. Like I said, when it and I feel like every time they 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 give somebody their energy, they're kind of triggered by something from their past. Like where it's like, okay, I used to do this. Like, you know how like I feel like when you when you're not healing or you're not you still connect with people from your like you either connect with people from your past or you connect with people who have the same traits as people from your past. You know how like when they say you're gonna keep getting the same lesson until you learn it. I feel like this person is starting to see that little by little with other people. Like, yeah, this is not what I want. Yeah. Like once somebody's learning themselves and they're learning their boundaries. It's like once they go out and they see, they like, uh-uh. Or this could be you. I cannot fucking make it up. This person got boundaries now. And even if they all going out and dating or whatever, whatever, it's like, nah, this ain't it. These options is not it. This not this not my person. This person like, no. This person could go on one date and it, it, it ain't work. They don't even be speaking to this person, these people no more. This I'm getting this is somebody who could even walk out on dates. Like, yeah, this ain't it. Because it's like they, they boundaries are so high. Yeah, with this trust and codependency, like I said, this could have been somebody who was b dealing with codependency issues. But at the end of the day, it's a mirror and energy that you and this person have to where it's like, yeah, I, I know where I'm going. Whoever you are, you're healing. I feel like you're focused. I feel like this person who's going out and seeing is like just showing them. Yeah, hurting. This person is still, this person still has some healing they need to do. I feel like somebody tried to mask their their feelings for you by hanging out with other people just to see where it would get them. And it didn't get them nowhere. So now they're realizing like, yeah, um, you know, this could have been somebody who was cold to love or like cold to commitment but i feel like this is something like when they try to when they started realizing that they had emotions and feelings for you it was kind of like all right to be on like kind of like let me make sure let me go out with other people and see how if i really like this person and it's like every time they go out with somebody they constantly thinking about you they wishing it was you like this person is knowing that, but because they're doing that, they're like, it's, they know it's some, it's inner work they have to do. This has nothing to do with you, collective. Simple. Yeah, confusion. 
and that card don't even go in this deck i hope i'm not confusing nobody so let me break it down it's somebody new that's coming in your way this is your person is what i'm getting like spirit is letting you know that this new love is worth the wait but what it is this person had to go through certain things and like i said this is somebody who got trust issues this is somebody who may have had codependency issues or they dealing with them now like you know how like you don't realize your triggers until you're being triggered i'm kind of getting this energy like that so where this person may not even have realized they had codependency issues but now it's like like i said this is somebody who was going out dating but it still was because they were stubborn, stuck in their ways. But it's like now, every time they go out, they're realizing like, you know, these people don't do it for them. These, like, it's you. I'm also getting that this person is kind of confused how they even gain feelings for you. Like this person is trying to, trying to figure out like, when did the feelings even come about? Yeah, eight of sword strength. <laughs> They're trying to have the strength to come up out of this like energy because somebody is in their head. Two of Pentacles. Ace of Ace of Cups. Nine of Swords. This person. could be juggling i don't know what it is that they're juggling oh it could be their finances but it's like they're wanting to come through what's this it's another card in here that don't belong okay new line of study this could be you collective you know, focusing on whatever you got going on, learning new things. Learning about the occult, like, but, hmm. This could be why this person also was held, held back on you because they didn't know what type of energy you was into for real. You know, this person could know that it's good and bad and everything, but it's like maybe this person, when they found out that you was into terror or that, they like kind of was like, you know, let me, let me hold back for some of y'all. But the, it left this person in this nine of sword energy, not bringing you this offer, this ace of cups. You know, now you got Ace of Pentacles. I'm also getting that something in your work is about to change. Like, something in your work is definitely about to change. With this Hierophant and Wheel of Fortune, things is about to be looking up for you. Nine of Cups, Nine of Pentacles, yeah. Yeah, then you got Temperance. Something is ending so balance can come in. I feel like you may be a little bit like, huh like restless or you know waiting for you just waiting for your moment but i feel like it's finna come it's definitely finna come because it's meant for you this is your birthright it's meant for you to have this it's meant for you and this person to be together you and this person like y'all it's something that y'all meant to do It's like this person is waiting for you. Butterfly effect. Yeah. Somebody's definitely waiting for you to transform. And it's like I said, they see the potential in you, so they know you have what it takes. And I feel like people don't fall in well, like when you heal, you don't really fall in love with a with potential anymore. You fall in love with what it is that people are doing. With like for real, for real. So I feel like this person knows that. Like whoever you are, you're healing, your energy is healing, and it's like they know you ain't gonna wait for them you understand what i'm saying so it's like if somebody really wants to be with you they gonna put in that energy to really be with you but this person is definitely transforming putting in the work
Okay, you got North Node, yeah. You give genuine love, be realistic, but don't play small, leave room for God. Sneezing, sign your answer, sign spirit, your spirit guides are communicating with you in 333. Three, three, I'm in alignment. So whoever you are, you're definitely in alignment for whatever's going on. Spirit wants you to keep your faith right now. Whatever you like are trying to manifest in your life, know that like you could really manifest it. Don't try to play yourself small or Oh, think that God don't have what it takes to give you what you really want because you do, you like, you're a powerful manifester and as long as you got God in your corner and God on your side, you're gonna, you're gonna make it, you're gonna make a way. And I feel like because whoever you are, you're somebody who's very genuine. It's no facade with you. It's no hidden agenda. It's no hidden motives or with you. I feel like this person is starting to realize that this person is starting to see that this is somebody who put you to the test. They want to see just what you're going to do in certain situations. How you're going to react to certain situations. But it's like whoever you are, you're definitely in alignment. Like you're definitely where you need to be at this very moment. Even if you may be in this Eight of Swords energy or not understanding like why things is moving slow. Like, or you could be confused like, oh, is this person, do they really want me? Or this, they're going, they're, they're healing. You know what I'm saying? This is somebody who had to set put boundaries up for even themselves. You know what I'm saying? Realizing like, yeah, people hurt you, but what you allow will continue. This is somebody who 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 they're doing the work. I will tell you that. This person is wanting to heal. This person is wanting to do the work. And this is why they're taking their time. Because like I said, the next person that they 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 come in into connection with. On some real stuff, they going, it's going all the way there. It's going to end their marriage and propose. This person is knowing though. They definitely, <laughs> something happened during this Halloween weekend or like over the weekend that where this person saw like, yeah, this is my person. I got to do the work. I got to do the healing in order to get, you know, to have it. Okay. Things, nothing's going to come easy. You got to put in some sort of work. You definitely got to put in some sort of work. So that's the message that I have for you all. And until next time.